Second round of the Rocket Mortgage Classic from Detroit. Matt Wolf getting uh, warmed up for his title defense at the 3M Open at Minnesota in a few weeks. Beautiful shot there into the 10th from 113 yards away. 64, low round of the day for Wolf, and he's in the weekend picture. So is Bryson DeChambeau. What else is new week after week? Threatening to win, will he bust down the door this week? DeChambeau is one back through 36 holes. Wolf for his birdie here at the sixth. Very streaky player. He missed a bunch of cuts and then just pop up and put himself in contention. And that's what's happening here this week. Chris Kirk, what a story developing. Winner on the Corn Ferry Tour just a couple of weeks ago. He shot 65. Lone bogey coming at the home hole, but he holed out at 11 from the bunker and right there at the 12th to move to 13 under par. He had the lead by a couple at that point. Nate Lashley was the defending champion. Beautiful tee shot here at the ninth in the middle of his round. Nearly jarred it. He was headed for the weekend until a bogey at 18. Cost him the cut. Webb Simpson, FedEx Cup points leader, second at 12. From 143, you can pretty much expect any iron shot this man strikes to be close. And that one just kind of fizzed in there inside eight feet or so. Simpson only missed one fairway and one green. This one right from the center of the fairway at 13 from 144. Nearly identical yardage as he had back at 12 and an even better result. Simpson would handle that one for birdie and move to 11 under par. Uh, some ingenuity here from K.H. Lee. That's how you play those shots. If you need to choke down to the steel and just Pop one in there at 17. It led to a birdie and it helped get K.H. Lee to the weekend. Simpson, as I mentioned, only missed one green. What happened when he did? That happened. Holding out for the bunker at 16. Good for a share of the lead at 12 under par. And he carries a share of the lead into the weekend along with Chris Kirk. Late birdie here at the eighth, his 17th hole of the day for Troy Merritt. To get him to nine under par, trying to win for the third time on the tour. Terrell Hatton's trying to win for the second time this season. Arnold Palmer Invitational Champion with the birdie there at 16 to move to minus nine. Tony Finau, par three ninth, final hole of the day, needed that for birdie to survive the cut. And Big Tony is on to the weekend after signing for 70 on Friday. And a late rally from Richie Warensky, birdie at the eighth, got him to 11 under. Warensky, one back through 36.